money well spent. That's how MP for Dago Martin Northeast, Colm Imbert, describes the official opening of the La Vigi Lookout in Paramin, which he believes will enhance the country's local tourism product. Sunilala has more. I wonder why La Vigi. Kurt came to me and said, what should we name the lookout? I said, what is Patwa for lookout? He said, Vigi. I said, well, La Vigi. MP for Diego Martin Northeast says there were delays in getting this $3 million La Vigi lookout completed, especially due to COVID-19, but praise homegrown contractors of Parmen for getting the job done on time and within budget. The La Vigi lookout boasts of several viewing decks, cooking sites, washroom facilities, and incredible views of the North Coast. Mr. Imbert says in a time of the pandemic where local tourism is critical, this facility significantly enhances that trust. As far as I'm concerned, this is money well spent. It has added value to this community. It has formalized a tourism location in Trinidad and Tobago, a fantastic tourism location, will help in our local tourism drive. And Tourism Minister Randall Mitchell is urging all tourism stakeholders to make use of what he says is a breathtaking facility. People who engage in a small hike from North Deck coming up all the way here and it will serve as a perfect rest stop. So I want to encourage the hikers to ensure that you bring your hikes here. I want to encourage all the tour guides, all the tour operators to ensure that you utilize this space. Mr. Mitchell adds that several other tourism products are also underway. We've also done some refurbishment works at the Galera Lighthouse in Toko. And we're also working uh, quite feverishly at the project at enhancing the Arapita Avenue um, project, which is to en enhance the Arapita Avenue experience, which is an entertainment zone. Minister Mitchell is also promising that there will be no water issues at the facility since the project will soon be underway to harvest rainwater at the site. Sonolala, TTT News.